did did you know the moving and all that situation affect your school? Like how how, how was school for you? Like how, what what type of school you were? See, school for me, I ain't got no no form of education behind me. You feel me? But like school with me, I'm gonna be honest, it was just like a fashion show. Give me some hoes. You know what I'm saying? I just I love social studies. But social studies, you ain't learning shit. You feel me? You teach yourself history. You feel what I'm saying? So it's like shit. Man, I um, I went to school all the way up to tenth grade. And it was just been so bad because I used to drive to school that way I, I see the error in the you feel me? Because I used to drive to school like eighth grade. I had got out of jail like going into seventh grade. No, going into eighth no, I got a jail going into ninth grade. Yeah. Then what the fuck it was too, you feel me? I had just been incarcerated for two fucking years and my mom and pulled the screen over at North Thee with Dr. Jones and got me in the fucking school how right I get out of jail. Yeah. You feel what I'm saying? But it was good over there because I ain't know nobody over there. It started fucking up when I got to my side of town. Yeah. Back in the hood now. What what was you getting in, in, in trouble and shit going to jail for back then? Shit, I went to jail for two kind of armed robbery, three kind of gang related terrorism at charge. I had got a uh, I had got I got I had got charged for a possession of firearm before, but it would have been aggravated assault, as I said on my, my dirty blood and you know what I'm saying, it wasn't just one where it and the nigga was my partner. You get what I'm saying? It wasn't just how the shit just played out the beat. You get what I'm saying? Like what happened, you know what I'm saying? But on paperwork and all that shit, it by what I'm it, exactly what I'm saying. You know what I'm saying? What 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 was some of the things that you know what I'm saying? You had to adjust to in them two years that you went to prison. I really had to adjust to. Fucking then, then love. You know what I'm saying? Like, like really, just yeah. cause I had love to love. That was the only thing I knew how to love. You feel what I'm saying? I loved it a little bit, and, um, and I was with it be three years, bro. Three. Listen here, I'm, I, ain't, I, I'm, I ain't even in and out my mama career, I'm fucking out. You feel me? I'm in the street. I'm over here on K Street. You know what I'm saying? On God back when the game when we jump. You feel what I'm saying? Type of shit. Goddamn, playing football in the backyard and running out the stores at nighttime because we thirsty and want some chill. Somebody gonna hold the door shit right there, we gone. You feel me? Going to the railroad, trash the food, park and eat shit. That's what I was doing and shit. And, and what my part my peace was with the little bit. You feel what I'm saying? Like she really made me feel like some. She would, when when me and my mom got the argument, I could really go to her, her chill with her, hug up on her, kiss up on her, and I'm dying. I like that energy ain't down no more. Yeah. You feel what I'm saying? Like I'm me. I'm good. I'm happy. Did my life? I'm living. How I want to live. I would kill the mentality. You feel what I'm saying? So um, I was locked up, man. You know, like four months in. And when I was locked up, they remind you, I ain't never in my life. Get a call for nobody, no one. I ain't never in my life had over four visits in the whole two years. I ain't never in my life talked to over five people over that phone in two years. You feel me? And the motherfuckers I did talk to a motherfuckers. The counselor let me call repeatedly, and there were people who was always out of reach, but I know who could get in reach to who I knew to talk to who my mother check home and see what's going on and did that. You feel me? Make sure everybody's straight. You know what I mean? So I would call a nigga like, 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 uh, Bobby, you know, it's old head, yeah, he raving, you know what I'm saying? Me a turn in my life for us and like putting up on when I needed some, you know what I'm saying? My mom used to deal with, they still deal with each other, you feel what I'm saying? But he was just a, a, a real nigga, you feel what I'm saying? A working man. He, I even gave me jobs, like prescription or shit, you feel me? So goddamn, uh, I, I, I called him most of the time because I knew he'd pick up, you know what I'm saying? He'd keep me at a level head, you know, he even just, just, just goddamn. Remind me of what I'm in there for. You know what I'm saying? So I won't forget. You know what I'm saying? Like, you know what I'm saying? Like, real nigga shit, be so. 
that shit. And and one day I was, um one of my partners was getting a call and he he had a sister and his sister was like in the neighborhood and shit and he, she was around some niggas and one of our partners got on the phone now you feel me and um, he was like oh well, go out back not go out much I'm sorry like, well, he said what well, be at would be <laughs> he said what well, mirror it, um, it was Tracy you know he still like but like and um. Jason said, Mill, um, so I said, I want you on the phone. I said, all right, I ran in the council about He said, hey, bro, you know that little bit, such and such. I said, yeah. He said, bro, such and such, that cream, that bit, the hood of JB. So it did, then such and such in here with me right now. Yeah. And such and such, my father. Yeah. But such and such, Jay came here with me. I promise you I ain't lying, D. Yeah. Cause I've been in here like six months now. You feel me? I'm like, what the fuck? Yeah. I'm psyching out. Yeah. Like, real shit, B. <laughs> Cause I'm like, whoa, I ain't even fuck this bitch, B. Yeah. How the fuck you do me like that? Yeah. You know what I'm saying? And I just had to realize it, man. Like, this shit ain't fair, man. You know, man. Like, this shit ain't fair, man. And I just had to, I just had to goddamn. Oh, oh, fuck it. No, I'm glad time went by. You know what I'm saying? Cause that, was the worst, that was the worst days of my fucking life being in the box. You feel what I'm saying? Though? And that, that was what it taught me, though, Jay. Like, man, you gotta know who the Lord is like, for real. You know what I'm saying? That shit'll tear you up, tear you down. That shit'll, that shit'll motivate you to be the richest nigga on this earth, too. You feel me? But bro, that shit would break you, bro. And that's what I was dealing with, you know what I'm saying? And shit, I dealt with that shit so many ways to I ain't have to deal with it no more. Like far as in, I I I, I healed myself in so many ways, like, oh fuck that bitch. You know what I'm saying? That's the healing. Like I'm putting that in my head, you feel me? Oh, 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 I ain't, I ain't never trust nobody. Else. When I get out, bitch, I'm doing my own thing. You know what I'm saying? Boom, that, uh, I'm good, I feel a little better now. Uh, I'm programming my head. You know what I'm saying? So it was just like, and I just molded that shit in my head. And the tears did it day. It fucked that bitch. Yeah. Uh. I won't join that bitch, gon' fall. Nigga won't stand on me if I die. Make sure my daughter's the son, alright? Just cause you broke over with a nigga, don't mean he gon' be there for life. I told my Lincoln, got back cold, nigga, say 